My name is Troy Tekish and I uh, am President and CEO of Kairos Autonomy. Started the company because there's a large market for robots and that market was not going to get smaller as time went forward. It was going to get much, much larger. We make a robotic applique kit. It's a, a kit that provides an unmanned capability to an existing manned vehicle. So the kit gives an existing vehicle the ability to drive itself. It fits uh, places where a man operates, so it's uh, ground vehicles like uh, cars and trucks and uh, you know big, big pieces of equipment like front end loaders and uh, skid steer vehicles and you, you name it, dump trucks, it doesn't matter. I've been working with Kairos for about eight years and a lot of our customers have uh, requirements for autonomous vehicles and uh, we use Kairos Autonomy uh, to provide kits to our customers. In some instances someone's operating it remotely so it's a remotely controlled vehicle. In other instances it's using GPS and other sensors to go ahead and actually drive all by itself and you've got a human operator just kind of monitoring it. When you go out and you talk to a lot of these robot companies and you ask them, hey, can I see one of your robots? They can show you a video or they can show you someone else's robot, but they can't show you theirs. It's because they don't produce them. The vast majority of these companies are software companies that produce software and technology that could go on a robot. We actually physically produce a set of hardware that's the same over and over again and then we can layer software on top of that for different ap applications. One of the great advantages of our technology is the same basic configuration can be installed on a wide variety of vehicles. Things as small as ATVs or golf carts all the way up to large military haul trucks or mining haul trucks, big dump trucks, front end loaders, things like that. The kit is done anywhere there's a repetitive task or a task that's too dangerous. And so, um, uh, such as uh, military targets. The vehicle would drive itself on one of the training ranges and then pilots would come in for fighter jets or for helicopter gun crews and they would engage the vehicle and try and disable it. Kairos was kind of innovative in uh, the kit market, having a self-contained system that would fit in any vehicle. It was uh, unusual to see such uh, high-level technology come out of Utah because we were not used to doing business uh, with companies in Utah. Since coming here and seeing the things they do, and uh, I've been very impressed with the, the quality of work um, and uh, specifically the responsiveness they are to, to various customers, how quickly they can um, keep up with the technology. We have a great uh, relationship with our customers. Our customers uh, need new features, need new additions. Um, we'll go ahead and respond quite rapidly. It's one of uh, the hallmarks of companies that I've run in the past is the, the relationship with the customer is key. It's uh, number one. If you've seen something you're interested in and you'd like more information, please contact us. We're, we're happy to provide assistance um, in any way that we can or, or work with you to meet your unmanned vehicle needs.